Okay, I'm gonna go over the difference between pure substances and mixtures. So with pure substances, there's two divisions. There are elements, and elements could be essentially anything on the periodic table. Great examples would be carbon, hydrogen, and sodium. Now, when you take two or more elements and put them together in a fixed ratio, you make a compound. Common compounds are substances such as carbon dioxide, dihydrogen monoxide, also known as water, and sodium chloride. There are also two divisions of mixtures. There are homogeneous mixtures, which are mixtures that look the same throughout. We say mixtures that are uniform. And by that I mean, if you were to take a sample of it, it would always look the same. A great example would be um, salt water. Like if you took salt and you dis dissolved it in water and every sample you took of that would always look the same. It would be blended perfectly. In comparison, a heterogeneous mixture has phase divisions. And by that, I mean you can see um, separations in the mixture. So let's say um, ocean water in comparison. And you might be saying, well, how is ocean water different than salt water. Well, ocean water has the fish, um, it has the sand, and all the other materials in the ocean, which would make it a heterogeneous mixture because you can see a lot of different um, phases, a lot, you know, solids and liquids and everything in the ocean water.